Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel and thank you so much for being here. Today we have a Fab Fit Fun, I think this was the summer surprise sale. So let's get in here and see what I've got. FabFitFun does so many sales now that it's difficult to keep up with which is which, but I think this is the summer surprise sale. I think that's what it was called. I have just a few items in here, plus a mystery bag that Jessica and I are gonna see who got the best mystery bag again. If you watched last time, Jessica and I, Jessica over at Everything Proof Beauty, went head to head to see who had the best mystery bundle. Just for bragging rights, nothing more, but I won. Thank you guys so much, everybody who voted, who watched both videos and voted. So we had so much fun doing it just because we have become such good friends through this and we've got a little rivalry thing going on with these bundles just to see who gets the best mystery bundle. It's kind of become a fun thing for us. So I'm going to unbox mine. She's going to unbox hers. We'll put our videos up on the same day and in our community tab, we'll have you guys vote again. So let's get in here. And I will tell you, as I am looking at my camera, I'm a little nervous because I have had this for a little while. And we've had all the FabFitFun spoilers and a couple other videos that I wanted to get up. And as I'm sitting here looking at this in the viewfinder, I don't know if you guys can see it, this is wet. <laughs> so I don't know whether it was set in something wet out when it was traveling or if something in there is broken. So let's find out. So like I said, I have had this one, I want to say even a couple of weeks. I have another sale coming. Either this was the surprise sale or that was the summer sale or... I just don't even know guys. Hopefully I will have worked it out and I will have told you in the title. Well, the bad news is I think the liquid's coming from me. This huge box with just a few things inside. I have my huge bundle, which is my mystery bundle and it seems to be dry, so that's the good news. I'm just gonna take all this out of here so we can see what the source of the problem was. I have whatever this is, I think it's a palette. It seems to be fine. I have the, <laughs> you guys are probably getting tired of seeing these, the Daily Concepts Stretch Washcloth. And the source of the problem, an NGS Everything Cleanser. Oh, I got this for my husband. I hope they can replace it. It is, oh, it, I, I'm not even taking it out of there. Because like I said, it's been sitting for a couple weeks. You know that's going to be sticky and nasty. But when I saw it, I thought, you know what? That would be really great for my husband. It's called the, oh, it's even worse when I put my glasses on. Oh, top of all. It says that the Everything Cleanser is a super green and mighty gel cleanser packed full of over 20 naturally derived ingredients that is a powerful yet daily face wash. And it's 100% vegan, cruelty-free, paraben-free. And it just kind of looked like something that my husband wouldn't mind using as opposed to some of the things that I try and get him to use, but no. So we'll put this back in here. I'm kind of almost relieved to know that it was coming from inside the box because if it had just been outside the box, I would have been like, oh. What is that? Okay, so back to unpacking what I've got. So I told you guys I have the Daily Concepts Daily Stretch Washcloth. You guys know if you watch the channel, we love these. I pick one of their products up probably every edit sale, whether it's this or the face wash things or the body scrubbers that's attached to a sponge. I just really like the Daily Concept products and they're usually about $5. So I will let you guys know down here prices if I can. Let's get into the next item. So I guess I only have two items other than that green cleanser to show you before we get into the mystery bag. And this one is Cotton Candy Champagne. I think this was Beauty Bakery, right? It's a blush lighter palette from Beauty Bakery. I got this for a giveaway. I just thought it was so pretty. So let's get in here and give it a quick look-see. So the front, I just had to work out how to open it. So the front of it just flips up and it opens and then you could just take out, you know, you can win me over with fancy packaging. And then this is the Cotton Candy Champagne Blush Lighter Palette. And on the back of it, it says, our Cotton Candy Champagne Blush Lighter Palette is here to give you major glow with four rose flushed shades. These metallic sheens will leave you feeling light and bubbly. So sit back, relax, and toast to a second serving of the Cotton Candy Champagne Blush Lighter Palette. And it has these cute little cotton candy looking fluffy things. I don't know how well those are gonna hold up. And then this, I'm gonna leave this plastic on here. This is the palette. And I just thought it looked really universal. And when I'm trying to do giveaways, that's what I'm looking for is a universal coloring. So I got that for a giveaway because 
I have managed to finally work out. I got a new printer. I worked out how to print postage. I finally got my postman to come pick up my boxes. So every giveaway that I have done, I have shipped. People have started receiving them. I am so happy. I am happy because that means I can now go forward with giveaways because I could not bring myself to do more giveaways until I had managed to give those away. All right, so again, that's it all closed up in its box. I'm gonna tuck it back because this is really, this bubble wrap is super thick. So I'm gonna put it right back in here so I will have it for when I ship it. Before we move on to my mystery pack, I received about the same time I got this. If you were here for my last sale unboxing, you know that I got a furry, ish lip product so I let them know and I heard back from them and they said they would send me a new one but they couldn't send me the same color so they sent me uplifted so let's get into it and see what it looks like I hadn't opened it yet I just put it with this box so I would remember to do it at the same time because I figured probably about the same people watch the videos this is the ish and again it is an uplifted and that is what the packaging looks like I think it's so classic like vintage 50s looking it is not fuzzy that is the good news. It is a very nudie neutral. I think that's a color I will use, so let's swatch it. Well, that is pretty. Definitely fall-like once I get it on my skin. It's a little warmer than I would wear in the summer, but that's got a great fall feel. It's a little dry, but I like that. All right, so that's the good news. So I had that dark fuzzy one, and it was indeed fuzzy. I don't think that was from the heat. It, I mean, when I got downstairs and in real light, and it was fuzzy. This one seems fine. Okay, well, let's dig into this mystery bundle. So again, if you didn't watch last time, it's Jessica over at Everything Proof Beauty and I. We're gonna show you our mystery bundles and then we're gonna ask you guys to go and vote on our community tabs. It's just for bragging rights. We are doing it just for fun. <clears throat> I happened to win last time. Thank you guys very much. I have to tell you, I was on the fence. I would have had a hard time voting last time if I had been you guys because I love, by the way, those bamboo utensils that I got last time, if I find those in another sale that FabFitFun is having, I will pick them up again. I am loving them. They are fantastic. But back to the point, Jessica got an Oribe highlighter that looked, it looked everything to me. I loved it. So I thought for sure when I saw her video that she had me beat, but I was so happy to have won. So thank you guys very much. But here we go again, and she may get me this time. So let's just get in here. Mystery bundles are $29. As a rule, you get four products. Sometimes you only get three if you get a really good one. But as a rule, you get four products. They say your value will be over $100. Right on top, I have, oh, I thought this was something that I already have. If you guys have watched my past FabFitFun videos, in an edit sale before, I did a poncho that looked very much like this that I got from my mother. And I thought that's what this is again, but this says, Turkish towel. Ooh, I'm intrigued. Let's get in here. It is so soft. It is just like cotton. It feels so good and it has a cute little tie on it. Let's open it up as best we can because this is a contest. Oh, the tie is attached. Let me show you guys. Got to show you guys all the great details so you'll know what you're voting for. This has a nice tie attached to it so when you're done you can always wrap it back up. I don't know that I've ever had a Turkish towel. It just feels like a gorgeous, it's huge. It's a gorgeous cotton towel. Is it? Oh my gosh. Guys, it is, I don't know if you can tell. It's, it's my wingspan. No, actually it's longer than my wingspan. It's from my fingertips to my fingertips. And it is so nice and thick and soft. The back of it is terry cloth. Oh my goodness, guys. So the front is a nice, gorgeous, soft cotton I'm wearing here, Jess. And the back is this gorgeous terry cloth. It has a very nice fringe. It's huge. Let's see. It says it's 100% cotton, machine wash cold. Yes. Tumble dry low, made in India. And it's a summer and rose brand. And that is, I think, one of the FabFitFun in-house brands. That is so nice. And just to prove I could, I super duper fast just wrapped it up again, okay? It didn't make it look as good as it did when we first got it, but it's kind of cute. Okay, let me show it this way. Oh, no. This is an awesome Turkish towel. I am so happy to receive that already. I bet the price of that, I will try and find it, but I bet the price of that thick, nice towel has got to come really close to my $29 value. I have little white fuzzies flying everywhere. Okay, reaching in next to things I can't see because now they're under a Turkish towel. I have ish. 
I have to tell you, I think Ish is another of the in-house FabFitFun brands. If you guys know, let me know below. This is the Probiotic Concealer in Light. This is very exciting. Let's see how light light is. I take light to a whole nother level. <laughs> and that is what that looks like. Please forgive my nails. I just realized I have not fixed them. Oh my gosh, guys, I think I can use this. Get out of here. What are the odds? Is it click? Oh, it clicks. What are the odds that I would get a concealer I could use? So it comes out just a little bit. Look how light that is. Let's swatch it. Oh, wow. Oh, it's creamy as all get out. I, BoxyCharm doesn't even do this well with matching my color. And this is just a random bag that they grabbed from FabFitFun. That is awesome. I love the way that feels. Right now I'm using a Fenty concealer, but it is getting very low and I will probably be very happy to have this. Let's reach in next. I have another ish product. It is the Lip Statement Single. Lip Statement Single in hip. Well, what is a lip statement single? Let's find out. Ooh, that's fun looking. It just says lip statement single, hip. Well, let's take this off. That is so cool looking. I feel like I've got to be missing something here. Stay with me guys. So this comes off. So this lives there and it comes out and then you have a little brush at the end. And then this is just a, a little pot of color. So you take your little brush. This is so fun. And it easily, oh wow. That's not exactly my color, but oh my goodness, guys. It goes on, do you see how smooth and creamy and the light shine that has? It might not, I'm a, I don't mind the color on me. It looks kind of orangish, but I don't know. I kind of like it. That's pretty awesome. So then you just put it all back together. I tell you what. I just went to take it in the realm of, I'm gonna have to do more research on that because I just went to swatch it off the back of my hand so I was sure not to get it on my Turkish towel or anything. And even after I took it off, can you guys see right here? I've got a streak of pink, so maybe it's got a stain in it too. Awesome. All right, reaching in for my last product, I have, I can tell from here, a Noto product. I have actually used one Noto product before and it was a oil. And it, the beauty of the Noto brand is they say they are gender free and cards on the table. I did not love the oil. I did not keep using it because since they are gender free, I found the scent to be a little too masculine to suit me, but that was just the oil. Let's see how awesome this scrub is. I'm sure awesome enough to win. This is the Noto Resurface Scrub Face and Body. Multi-use, two ounces. That is what the box looks like. And this is what the jar looks like. Let's see if this says anything. I will tell you what it says. It says that this will be going in a giveaway, so I'm not going to open it because the very first ingredient in this is walnut shell powder. I am allergic to walnuts. I am highly allergic to walnuts. So this is walnut shell powder, organic aloe leaf juice, organic lavender flower, Roman chamomile flower water, organic jojoba seed, rosehip seed oil, organic white willow bark extract, glycolic acid, peppermint oil, blood orange oil, pro-vitamin B5, and vitamin E. Those are the hero products. That sounds fantastic. And it says you just scoop it out and apply to wet skin. The water will allow the product to foam gently and massage in circular motions and rinse to pat dry. That sounds really awesome. I'm kind of sad I can't use it, but I am happy to have it for a giveaway. I still think my bag was awesome. Okay, so in total, I have this nice Daily Concepts scrubber, this Beauty Bakery cotton candy champagne blush and highlighter, which I bought intentionally to go into a giveaway. And then, oh, oh, and I have my mess down there. You know, the face wash that made a mess. Then I have my awesome mystery bag, which I'm gonna put up against whatever Jessica has. I have no idea what that is yet. It could be incredibly awesome, but I think mine's awesome. I got this gorgeous Turkish towel, cotton on one side terry cloth on the other. Definitely a winner, guys. I have the nice Noto that I'm going to put in a giveaway with the walnut shell powder. 
the awesome ish products which i'm surprised to say that because after our last ish lipstick situation but these are fantastic i have a probiotic concealer in my color and this cute little lippy with the little all right so in our community tabs we will each put a poll and it will just ask you whose was better mine or jessica's so you have the opportunity to vote twice if you'd like to so now that you've seen mine go over and check out jess if you haven't seen jessica anyway you're gonna love her you should definitely go over and check out her channel she does unboxings and hauls and she gives such great information about the products she's funny trust me you guys will love her. So go over, check out this video. Like I said, you can vote on both channels. I think last time I beat her like 60, 40, so we'll see how I do this time. But be sure, despite how much I do appreciate y'all's loyalty, you vote for whichever mystery bundle you like best. And I will see you guys really soon. Also, I will put the link to Jessica's video below to make it easier. So thank you so much for coming by, guys. I really appreciate you taking the time to come over, say hi, please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you'll know when I have more videos coming out. And I'll see you really soon. Bye, guys.